Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel. And, uh, well, it's getting worse for uh, AMD CPUs, but uh, don't, uh, don't be too happy and smile if you're on an Intel uh, processor because uh, look at my next video. That's coming up in a few minutes. Um, it's, it's not a good week for processors. So what's happening is that, of course, we, all, we, we talked about it in the past couple of weeks, uh, Zen 2, uh, Ryzen, and AMD CPUs were target of a security flaw that could be used. And uh, that, of course, means that you could have uh, you know, personal information leaked. But not just that. It goes to the point where you know, it could be used for an attack against uh, someone that, um, you know, wants to really uh, mess up your PC. Security was, uh, was a problem there. And, of course, AMD said they would, refer, you know, release firmware updates uh, for or microcode updates for their processors. So if you have a Ryzen and AMD processor. But now it's getting a little more heated because something new that um, security researchers have discovered is um, a new and powerful uh, transient execution attack, and it's called Inception. So, of course, this can actually leak all sorts of privileged secrets, data, and all sorts of information. It could also be used in an attack to create buffer overflow and even have you know remote code execution happen. So this actually affects basically every zen based cpus from amd so that's pretty much everything uh a bunch of cpus so now it's a much larger attack possibility it's a much larger security problem uh no real uh info as to when microcode will be released for most of you that have pcs that come from a manufacturer like my Asus that I have here, this should come in Windows Update at some point. But AMD has been contacted a few times, and they aren't saying when microcode updates will be released. One of the things that they are probably working on, because some of the microcode tests that apparently they've been doing slows down the PC so much, that it is impossible to push an update like that to computers because people are going to go crazy. So um, probably what's happening is that they're working on code, the microcode. They're testing microcodes. They're testing performance issues with the microcode in question. And when they get something that doesn't um, really impact systems too much, they'll release it at that time. But uh, for now, um, it seems that they're having a hard time getting microcode. And especially if you have an old AMD computer, the older computers, apparently it bogs them down so much that um, they just don't want to release this. The good news, nobody's right now exploiting this. The good news is it's, there's no attacks in the wild or nothing. Uh, and hopefully uh, this will be fixed before anything like that happens. And remember... If you follow the security the security rules of being careful what you do online and making sure that updates of every software is there, this really mitigates and lowers the risk of any attacks using this flaw. So just be careful. But if you're in the category that downloads illegal movies, uh, cracks for games, and all sorts of you know clicks on everything, you are at risk. You are at higher risk because of these attacks if somebody starts exploiting this. That's why you got to be careful. Forget about antivirus. None of them are going to protect you from a uh, exploit to the uh, Zen CPU problems. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe. Give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.